Hi, Hi. How are you? Welcome. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thanks for coming. Yes, I've been trying to, to get over here for, for a while and it seems fitting right after Hanukkah. Uh, I'm here and going to help you deliver some loaves of love. Exactly. So t tell me more about the program. We got a nice donation a couple years ago saying, please spend this money for people who need it, but make it something Jewish. And we were just kind of brainstorming. And I said, my dad, who's in Pennsylvania, um, works, volunteers at the hospital, and he delivers challahs every Friday to people, patients already in the hospital. And from there, it just blossomed. It was about three years ago. Um, and we delivered... 1,315. 1,315 loaves of challah, just like this. Just like that. Wow. We do about 60 every, one Friday a month. I'm sure that there is a lot of requests to make it more regular than just once a month. Mm -hmm. We do get donations and um, they kind of trickle in and so that keeps the program going. So it costs about $300 um, for 60 loaves. So that's how much, and our volunteers volunteer their time, so there's no other cost. So every, every month when you deliver the, the 60 loaves, it's about $300 mm -hmm. for that program, yep. okay? How can they sign up for the program or learn more? They can contact Jewish Council for the Aging and 301-255-4204, um, and we will put them on the list. This looks like a, a, a good challah. It is. And, and yeah, a lot of people cannot get to the bakery. Um, these are folks who have challenges like physical, cognitive, emotional. So you get them from Sunflower Bakery, which makes it even more meaningful, right? Yes, yeah. So they have a mission similar to Jewish Council for the Aging. Um, they serve a vulnerable population also and provide a training program for them to learn how to, to bake bread and we serve a vulnerable population also. So aging with early memory loss here. So individuals with uh, various disabilities are making challah mm -hmm. and then you are giving them exactly. to others yep. who need assistance. Yep. Uh, that is the circle of challah. It is. <laughs> <laughs> well, once I learned about the program, I knew I wanted to, to help learn more uh, and, and deliver a loaf. Uh, I would be willing to deliver more, but you've already gotten, uh, yep. you've already delivered them. That's it. You're the last one. So this is it. <laughs> this is the, the, the lone is loaf, the loaf. That, that I will be helping yes, to deliver. Yeah. The name is probably one of the most appropriate names for, mm -hmm. for a program. Lo loaves of Love. Yeah, yes. Eli's Loaves of Love. Eli's Loaves yeah. of Love. They, um, my dad died about a year and a half ago, and, they, and that's when they changed the name to Eli. So, so food was his thing, and you, and you've, you've expo a, exported it down thing. to Montgomery <laughs> County. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, we wanted to name it after him. A, a wonderful way to, to celebrate and remember your dad, um, bit by bit, week by week. Yep. Thank you, Eli. <laughs> Made me cry. <laughs> uh, tell me about volunteering and, and helping Loaves of Love. Oh, I love that. I get to interact with them, and they're wonderful, and I always get a big smile on their face and it just gives me goosebumps every time I get to go. It's amazing. It's amazing that we were able to do this and the bread smells so good in my car. It's amazing that they get delivered. I have resisted every <laughs> temptation to peel off a piece right, while it's been I'm, in my possession. I'm hoping they're not home. So <laughs> I get to have Let's go pleasure. deliver. Let's go. I may have COVID-19. This is um, County Councilman Evan Glass. Nice to see you. I'm sorry you're feeling under the weather, but we, we come bearing challah. We're, we're so glad that we have a loving and caring community that provides not only housing for people who need it, but food for people who need it too. And I, I wish you a happy and healthy holiday, okay? Yeah, my wife is uh, marginal dementia for some time now, and it's really, you know, it just picks these people up. It just literally, that's a good way to put it. It's a, a strong sense that you guys have of, of community, of a sense of giving, not taking, but giving. And that's what I'm talking about with these organizations. It's, uh, it's really, really something. So you've got to keep it up and keep giving me that delicious yeah. thing. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, what we'll do is if you want to go inside, I'll put it down and, and leave you with some of this good stuff, okay? Thank you. 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 Thank you.